here at the Goodwill. Just before work. Let's see if we can find anything new. It's been about a week since I've been here. Let's check it out. Still remember the old commercials. Like it was yesterday. Star Trek. Star Trek audiobooks. 2010. I need too many. I really need too few. Where's the one? This looks like all the same crap. In the Darkness Silver. A movie there. And the chipmunks go to the movies. Somebody's been doing some stealing, it looks like. Sounds nice. And down here, Thomas the Magic. Thomas and the Magic Railroad. I watched that when I was a kid, I think. At least once. <laughs> At least one time. Wasn't a big, wasn't a big one. Thomas the Tank Engine. I've been coming on early in the morning, some, some weekend days or school days or something. Franken Thumb. Oh my goodness. Well, I collect Frankenstein movies. I guess I need Franken Thumb if it's in there and if it's in good shape. Some HD DVDs for that ass. Unleashed and Fearless. Two jet movies. Pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just full of ducks. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's nice. Blubber. Hey, hey, hey. It's Fat Albert. Still need this on DVD or Blu-ray, the entire collection. One of my favorite shows of all time. I don't own it in any capacity. And that break my heart. Break my heart. I look behind. Listen for and testigo in peligro. Testigo testify in danger? Ask media, help me out. Testify, maybe testify in danger. I know it's witness. So I think it's testified. I know peligro is danger. There's an in, in, in. Reading fire, Bolo Young. Yep, Bolo Young. He's not on the cover. Instead, we have Juan Ojeda on the cover and Jonathan K. Kwan on the cover. Jonathan K. Kwan, uh, isn't that Goonies and what you call it? Uh, Indiana Jones, of course. Short round. This is a lot of the same stuff here. Slow down on the Beatles Alistair movies. And watch a few first. Martina McBride, Kelly Slater, Martina McBride. It's a name that like died in the 90s. I can't even name one of her songs. movies of all time. It's up there. Not for real. I'm not just saying that. It's not hyperbole. I'm dead. Serious. Alright. Well, I'm gonna check these and I don't know if I'm taking this. No. You know, I'm not taking that. I'm gonna check this one out. See if it looks good. And we are at the restore before work. Let's check it out. Let's see what they got. Here we are. Alright. 
Alright, fingers crossed. We've had really the same ship for quite some time now. Ronin. Good old Ronin. Love Ronin. Love John Frankenheimer. <clears throat> ah, carrot top. Sweet. I've been looking for that. I've been looking for carrot top. <sighs> the ref. Still need to see the ref. Two really good things about that one. Let's see what we got here. Rails and ties. We um, Kevin Bacon. Hmm. I know nothing about that. <sighs> okay, well, another underwhelming trip to the, uh, to the restore here. Let's see, there's another one here. Actually, Penguins, uh, it's like one of the most common DVDs ever. Oh, we got a stack up there. See, I hate this. I wish they would just separate the DVDs from the VHS, for Christ's sake. It makes it hard. <laughs> Way, way, right? American Civil War, a nation divided. Hmm. What do you know? Zobu Mafu. Zobu Mafu. Sensational animal friends. If these guys were doing their thing now, they'd have a YouTube channel. Okie doke. Alright, another rainy day here in Smithville, North Carolina. We're gonna check out the Salvation Army first door. Let's do it. Here we are at the movies, and they actually don't have many DVDs at all today. But let's take a look. Well, that's actually something I'm looking for. This is like a, a 90s baseball anime. Um, I grew up a baseball fan, so I still have a love for it. Um, for the game, it contains five episodes. This, I think, is like the fourth volume or something. I have them at my bookstore, but you know, they're like three bucks a piece. I might grab this if the condition's good. Um, so we're gonna check check on that. Uh, ooh, some Twilight Blu-rays. What is it? Okay. Well, wow. Underwhelming. We got a bunch of books down here. Some VHS. Yeah. Wow. Well, I'm gonna look at this. Ooh, what do we have here? Barnes and Noble set. Oh, Henry. Oh, Henry. I don't know Oh, Henry. Barnes and Noble's always does great uh, books like this. Um, I'm actually reading Frankenstein Barnes and Noble right now as we speak. Just finished Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Oh, Barnes and Noble edition, so. I'm gonna see if Oh, Henry's somebody I care about. I know you don't, guys don't care about books. Well, some of you may. Alright, I'm gonna check these two. See what we're taking. So this, I wanna grab, but it says uh, for, for promotional use only, so I'm hoping it doesn't have, like, you know, uh, watermark or anything like that. But for a buck, I'm gonna take a chance. Alright, we are at some random thrift store that I haven't been to in quite some time. Let's see if they're even open. They are. Let's see what they got. So, they got a bunch of movies. They always have some movies, mostly VHS, but. Let's see. Oh, there are some, some DVDs. Wildfire. It's Lionsgate. It might be out of print. I don't think I'm interested, but it might be out of print. Wonderland. What's that? Image. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe interested. I'm not sure. Whoa. Got a lot of heavy hitting history stuff here. Some of which may touch something. The thorn birds. I prefer the thorn berries. I'm gonna look up almost all these just in case. Like sometimes random things like this I'll go for a crazy amount. Blackwater vampire. What the hell is this? It's obviously a low-budget horror film. Ooh, documentary film. Might be found footage. Obscure found footage horror. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna look all these up. 
see if there's anything worth grabbing. All right, well they do have, you know, I found a little stack. Um, this I'm interested in, that. I'm actually interested in these two, but I'm gonna probably sell them off to fund what I am really interested in. Hijacking catastrophe. Looks like a bunch of like, how do you say, crap. Never heard. Never heard. which I doubt they will definitely fetch something. Some, a little something, some. I doubt this is worth anything, but you never know. Big fish, invisible circus. Never heard of this. Might be interested in that, personally. Orphanage, I have roots. Never know what these history ones fetch. Check these out, too. We at the Dollar Tree. I haven't been to this one in quite some time. They probably have some movies. Let's hope they do. Let's see what they got. All right, they don't have much. <laughs> some Blu-rays there, we're gonna start here. Look at everyone, since there's not many. Dark Horse, I've seen that a thousand times. The Crimson Field. BBC, huh. Not really anything I'm interested in, to be honest. Despite it being a Blu-ray. I'm sure there's some BBC fans, BBC uh, television fans, I should say. Weirdsville I picked up, I don't know, last year or something like that. Had a Dollar Tree, probably this Dollar Tree. <laughs> no, Mom, my perfect life. Foodies Valentine. Get shit wooden. Rock oh, cool. sorry, here's the, the exciting part. Our age, I already have it. I already have it. Bang Bang Club, but I don't think I care. Kiss of the Damned, that's cool, but I do have it. Renegade Male Flight Attendant. attendant. What in God's name? Well, not interested. Hey, that's my first failure at the Dollar Tree in quite some time. I've just gotten good timing um, as of late, but you win some, you lose some. On to the next. All right, we're here at the Garner Goodwill or Garner Clayton. I don't know. It, the boundary lines in this in this area are not very distinct. But yeah, we're at a Goodwill. Let's see what they have. All right, here we are at the movies. I've been here in a while. Last time I was here, I found the incredible Nintendo or Super Nintendo lot. This is the same Goodwill. See if they have anything appealing today. Mm -hmm. A lot of uh, same old stuff here. Humboldt County. I see that one often. Humboldt County. Is it weed leaves on there? Uh, drug content. I'll have to look this one up. I don't know anything about this. Oh, it's got a giant joint on the front there. Characters standing on it. Cool. Gotta look into that. Got to look into that. Lassie, triple feature. Wow. No thanks. Oh my god. I doubt this is out of print or anything. Great in the bowl, volume three. Five episodes. If you know me. I want four seasons. I ain't got time for that. I found it. At least. At least put it in where I found it. Haunted no. ghost stories. Sounds spooky. Parks. What's that? Oh, it's like skating stuff. Okay. So much of that. So much skating stuff. That I come across and snowboarding. Uh, actually, some of them are hard to find, and some pe some people uh, pay good money for them. But it's like hit or miss, and I don't know about it. Party Monster. I don't think I have Party Monster. That's what I want. That is what I want. 
Good Friday, land of the black. Incendiary. Incendiary. Huh. Yeah. Looks way too generic. Legends of Tomorrow. Huh. I wonder if I could resell that. I'm not interested. Unconditional love. American Horror Story Hotel. If that was a Blu-ray, I'd, I'd grab it. But, which is not. Supergirl. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if those are saleable. You know what I mean? Profitable. But, well, maybe. I could always fetch a few bucks. Out of print. It doesn't go out too bad, too much. Yeah. It's not bad than scratch, like if it was for the collection I'd grab it, but to sell, nah. Oh, nah. This is a beauty in the beast Blu-ray, but I, I don't think these go too much. I mean, they can this anyway. You'd think it would, but it's like seven bucks on eBay, you know. Black sales. And a bunch of seasons. I don't know. She didn't sound bad. The Blu ray is very hard to find. These sell for like 10 bucks a pop. Yeah, if it's in good shape, I'll grab it. 10 bucks, I say, but now after all the fees and everything, I make three or four. Oh, at least four, I'll say. Hello Kitty. <laughs> As an anime fan, Japanese animation fan, it's like, I'm, I'm interested. It's obviously not going to be something I enjoy, but as a collector. I don't know, this might even fetch something. I'm sure that Hello Kitty's huge. Everybody knows Hello Kitty worldwide, so. The good flakes, but just not stuff that I, that I need. Because, because, because. Yeah, see, snowboarding. Shanghai Nights. It's good to see Jackie. There's mine, is it? Ah, that might be it. That, this is when I used to watch it. Um, I might be interested in that, actually. R. Kelly. The R. Kelly. Like, for real. He used to love his music. Not anymore. Natalie. He's a 90s film. You don't see often. 98. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not positive on any of these, really. You know me, I'm just gonna... The Maybe Pile grows. Vietnam Combat, Arrow 4th season. Later seasons usually fit a little more. I'm not interested in any of that CW shit. I'm just not. Nothing against people who enjoy it. It's just not for me. Well, there's a whole collection of We Just Dance games. Some of those sell for a bit if they're newer. The newer, the better, but, you know. Hey, I'm in the Assassin's Room Specialist. Two of my favorite best movies. The Flash. Oh. I don't know what those are going for, man. Any of those seasons, really. American Hitfall. Oh, childhood favorite of mine. Time Big. I feel like I've seen this recently. I don't know. I don't know. It's weird what, like, sparks my interest and what doesn't, I don't know, has something to do with the art and the people involved, you know. Ready for the world, there you go. Boy Meets World, ooh, I don't think I've seen seven, I've seen one. Oh, 3 dollars bite me. Bite me. Bite. I'm not spending that much at Goodwill. Alright, let's see. I don't know. Look into that film. Check the Wikipedia. Let me know how you feel about it. It's not for the faint of heart, though. Palo Alto. I will say that much. I think one between love and hate. Picked that up recently. One last film. One of his first, actually. Star. 
Printing story one and two. Three is out of print. That one's fetches. Simon Says featuring Dennis Rodman. His action, his film, one of two. Double Team and Simon Says. S-E-Z. Step into liquid. There's another surfing one, see? Mm, yeah. Holographic. Refractive, I should say. I'll look that one up. Maybe it's worth something. Probably not. Low budget wrestling shit. All right. Well, I need to pick this up. It's in good shape. Yep. I might snag that. Okay. Well, nothing too exciting. I'm gonna see if I can make anything. See if I'm buying anything. We'll see what I'm taking. All right. Stopping at the Goodwill after work. Really switching it up today. Let's hope they got something new. And exciting, preferably old. All right, so it looks like somebody straightened up the movies nicely, which makes it a little easier for me to look through them. So thank you, whomever did so. Do I count as that? I looked at this already. This is the one that was short lived. Didn't last very long in the early 2000s, mid 2000s. Interesting. I love the case, by the way, the color. The turtle color. Oh, my dear heaven. Oh, my dear heaven. Well, it's never gonna play again. It breaks my heart. Dooby dee, dooby dee, -dee, -dee, -dee. Moving along, moving along, duck walking. Alright. Looking through all these games, I feel like it's the same thing. Placer, placer de agradecer. Flutter! Yeah, I've seen these. I've probably seen behind it too. These are newish. Oh, wonderful. The Wiz. Do I own the Wiz? I don't know if I own the Wiz. Not sure. Pirates. It's like a Japanese knockoff. Chinese knockoff. Pirates. WC Fields. <laughs> Chinese bootleg of Twilight New Moon. Oh my goodness, look at that. You don't see that often, do you? This might fetch something. Of course, you know, I have this on Blu ray. I watched this movie uh, so much on VHS when I was growing up. So much that we had to. Buy a new VHS. Snowed in at the house of the mouse. Well, I'm interested in this. Sometimes these uh, go for tons. Random, obscure Disney ones. Well, those are, these are all new here, so let's see if there's any more behind. Do -de do Adventure Time. Ooh, Adventure Time. Season 3. Cool. Love Adventure Time. I should say, I love what I've seen. Who is this VHS of the game? Here you go! Cool VHS, actually. I'm gonna look this one up, too. You never know. Like I said, some of these Disney ones. Some of them I'm interested in. Some of them I'm not. Let's see if there's anything new here. Safe Haven. Romantic. I'm not into it. Not into it, man. Footloose. Not into it. Speed Racer I have on Blu-ray. It's like a new Speed Racer, though. It's like a CG one. No, it's hand-drawn. Hmm. First one the next generation. It's kind of cool. Mm, put in the maybe pile. Yeah, no. You know how I do. Shrek the Halls. Get it? Clever. Cats and dolls. Or Wonder Kitty Glow. Okay, well, that's cool. I've seen some of the show, and I love it. I'm not to mess anything up. I don't want to be that guy that doesn't put things back where they belong. I've 
some of the ones in here. It's all the bad stuff just gets pushed to the back. Never heard of him. Scooby Doo, a bunch of Scooby Doo stuff. Which one the ghost? You know how it goes with Scooby Doo, they're always destroyed. This one's actually in okay shape. Alright. I go with this one. It's an older one. That's why I'm snagging it. 99, 90s. Let's see. Uh, this monster. It's another. It's kind of cool. Uh, I've never really gotten into Scooby Doo, you know, but I'm interested in doing so. Of course, I grew up watching some. Nice. Had this exact VHS when I was growing up, of course. It's another movie I watched until the tape broke. I let my tape rock till my tape pop. Okay. Get a clue, Shaggy and Scooby Doo, get a clue. You guys tell me if these are worth picking up, you know? Maybe next time I come. Wow, like the, all the Scooby Doo here. Chinese, maybe they're legit Chinese copies. I don't know if that exists. You know, the copyright laws are nearly non existent in China. Worship guitar. Magma. Liquid hot magma. I made that joke. Terminator 1 and 2. That's cool to see. Alright. Secret of the too. Huh. I assume that. Did Bluth have anything to do with it? No. <sighs> maybe. Just go in the maybe pile. Spot kid is game over. Hallmark. A lot of these Hallmark ones, FHE ones, are out of print. I'll have to double check on that. Ice Age. Do I have Ice Age? I don't think I do. I might. If I do, I could trade it at the store for a book. Bookstore that I work at. Huh. <laughs> I really don't feel like looking behind these. <laughs> it's unlike me, I know, but let's hope there's nothing crazy cool behind. Exercise DVDs and movies, most of which I have. Okay, I'll do it. All right, I'm gonna see what I'm taking. All right, ended up taking a stack from Goodwill. Not taking, purchasing. <laughs> nice stack here, but you'll have to wait till the end to find out what I got. A few things to sell, definitely to make more than my money back for what I'm keeping. And that's how we do. Um, a lot of them were in really good shape, so whoever brought all these movies took care of them. And you can't really see my face, but that's okay. That's gonna do it for today's thrifting. Let's check out what we got. All right, so today was more of a day of me buying things to sell. Um, this is the stack of stuff that I'm going to be putting up on eBay. Uh, I mean, you've got an array of, of different things. Very diverse collection. Everything from Auschwitz, you know, World War II documentaries to Wii games to uh, a Region 3, by the way, of Michael Jackson's Moonwalker. Mama Flores Family goes for like 15 bucks. The Mickey one uh, fetches about 15. Jane Silent Bob always makes me a few bucks profit. Yeah, I'm just, these I'm just not too interested in. Roots I already have. You know, the games I already have, of course. Thornbirds doesn't seem like my speed. 
Um, but yeah, so I wanted to show you guys the stuff that I will be getting rid of, making a little bit extra. And as for the stuff that I'm keeping, this is the Selected Stories by O. Henry, which is not focusing because of low light. I always enjoy that when that happens. I hope you guys do too. All right, we're going to do it standing up. Oh, Henry, early 20th century New York writer. Short stories about the common man. Um, sounds like something I'd be interested in, so I picked it up. Frank and Thumb. Frank and Thumb, it's a Frankenstein movie starring all thumbs. And it's Steve Odenkirk. It, it, uh, Frank and Thumb. The Wedding Singer. Believe it or not, an Adam Sandler movie that I haven't seen. <laughs> Um, I've, I grew up watching all of his stuff from the 90s, but this one I somehow missed. So I'm adding this to the collection, and I want to check this out soon. Soonish. We've got Party Monster. This is supposed to be a crazy, like, New York club scene from the 80s and 90s. Drug-fueled violence. Macaulay Culkin and Seth Green. And Marilyn Manson. And Dylan McDermott. Adventure Time! Season 3! Come with me to the butterflies and bees! I love this show. I've only seen the first season, but it is a great animated show. Glad to have the third season here. I think this came with a slipcover at some point, but that's okay. I don't need the slipcover. Blackwater Vampire! Fear the Darkness. This is a vampire found footage film that's supposed to be a lot like Blair Witch, like a Blair Witch ripoff. So to find this is really cool. I'm a big found footage horror fan and I found an obscure found footage horror film at a random thrift shop. That's what this is all about. Blackwater vampire. And to be honest, that looks like the Jeepers Creepers guy. And it's kind of creepy. Princess Nine! Or as the Japanese might say, Princess Nine! This is a Grand Slam. I, I think this is like the fourth or fifth volume of this late 90s, I believe, or 90s, early 2000s, maybe, baseball anime called Princess Nine. I am interested in this because I loved the game of baseball growing up and still do have a love for it, even though I don't care about it or watch it or play it or anything. Princess Nine, Grand Slam. And last but not least, Scooby-Doo and the Witch's Ghost from 1999. Finally found a Scooby-Doo movie that wasn't destroyed by the little demon children that watched them. So that is Scooby-Doo and the Witch's Ghost. I just want to thank you all for checking out this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I'd love to know what you've picked up recently at thrift shops and pawn shops or wherever you found some movies or games or whatever. Let me know what you found down in the comments below. We'll get a little discussion rolling. Ah yes, if you enjoyed this video, feel free to give it a thumbs up, and if you're new to the channel and want to see more videos like it, go ahead and hit the subscribe button, as well as the little bell for notifications. Anyway guys, I will see you all next time. Board Cyborg is out.